Hello everyone, Mr. Mugen here. I wanted to take this opportunity to use a tool that I've just encountered called Screencastify to share with you some information about goal setting. Goal setting gives us a chance to live the powerful life that we're all hoping for. Why goals? Because humans accomplish 100% of the goals they never meant to set. Someone's going to get a ticket this afternoon for driving choices that maybe weren't the best. They didn't set out a goal to accomplish that, but humans accomplish 100% of the goals they never meant to set. In a bigger picture of life, those individual choices lead to an entire life lived. Goal setting gives us a chance to take some direction with our life, and that direction is powerful. This is where I intend to go, and these are the steps I'm going to take to get there. Because if you don't know where you're going, any roadmap will get you there. So what's the difference between a goal and a dream, a goal and a wish? Let's take a close look at the characteristics of goals. Goals need to be challenging. If I always do what I've always done, I'll always get what I've always got. Therefore, when I challenge myself with a goal, I'm going to be pushed to new levels. Next, goals need to be visible. If my entire life's passion is to be a nurse, I don't necessarily have to put that on a post-it note. If my entire life's goal is to be in the Olympics someday, I don't need to tie a string around my finger. But perhaps steps towards that goal need to be kept visible. If I'm going to be an Olympic athlete, I need to work out every single day. Maybe I would check that off on a calendar to keep my mini goals visible on the way towards my ultimate goal. Goals need to be challenging and visible. Goals need to be specific. What exactly do I intend to do? Specific is related to measurability. Can I actually see that I've gotten this done? So if my goal is to be an Olympic athlete, how is that measured? Well, maybe mini goals would be I'm going to get into the, into the gym every single day and I'm checking that off on the calendar. If I go back to the specific goal of being a nurse someday, perhaps I need to take courses towards that end goal. So as I take those courses, I might check those off or mark those down on a transcript to keep them visible. Goals need to be specific, measurable, but also action-oriented. Action-oriented goes hand-in-hand hand with being realistic. Can I actually take steps towards this goal? Is it something that I can accomplish? When I was a young boy, I wanted to be an astronaut. However, my eyes were bad. Thank you very much. Back in the 70s, astronauts had to have per perfect vision in the days before LASIK surgery. So it was not realistic for me to be an astronaut. There were no action-oriented steps I could take to accomplish my goal. Goals need to be challenging, visible, specific, measurable, action-oriented, realistic, and perhaps the most important and most often forgotten portion of a goal, goals need to be timely. In other words, they need to have a deadline. This is when I'm going to get this course taken in my nursing program. This is how many individual sessions I'm going to get at the gym by the end of this month. A deadline. And all of these things give us an opportunity to take direction towards our ultimate goal, which is the top of that mountain. CV SMART Goals. The way to live powerful life with direction that we're all hoping for. Thank you so very much for listening. Hope you enjoyed our investigation of how to set goals.